Hey guys, Coach Katie here with Coach Josh. We're gonna show you this week's simple and sinister er workout. So there's gonna be six stations, one exercise at each. You're gonna be at each station for 40 seconds, and then you have 20 seconds to rotate to the next station. We're gonna do four total rounds. You ready, Josh? Let's go. Okay, on the ropes, you're gonna do five slams and then 10 waves. So, hard as you can, slam that rope five times, and then you're gonna count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and then back to five slams. So five slams, 10 waves, as many of those sets that you get in in those 40 seconds. Oh boy, it's gonna be a good one. Yeah, right? And then station number two, you'll come over here to the wall, and this is a new one. So you're gonna do a reverse lunge up to a wall ball. So, reverse lunge, drive up on that front foot, slam that wall as you come up out of that reverse lunge. So get that knee as close to the floor, drive up on the front foot, Squeeze that glute at the top, slam that wall with that ball hard as you can. If you need to for any reason, take the lunge out, you'll just do those wall ball slams where you squat down, drive up, slam the wall. Station number three, slide squat row. So sit back, drive up and pull. Now I'm gonna have Josh pause at the bottom. Notice how his butt is not lower than his knees. 90 degree angle, this is too low. We want you to go here. Drive up, drive those heels into the floor, squeeze your glutes. Pull, squeeze those shoulder blades at the top so you're using your legs and your upper body to drive that sled all the way down. Then put those handles up at TRX around your wrist. Push the sled all the way back. And you should have time to go again, so then you'll go again. Leave that sled wherever it is when we call time. And then station number four is a kettlebell clean and squat. So clean position, clean it up. Deep breath in, blow it out as you drive up. Again, totally straight up, and then drop down into the squat. So make it a nice, clean, solid clean. Drop down to the squat. So it's two separate movements. Clean, and then squat. Take it back down and reset. Clean and squat each side. Station number five is over on the rower. So you're gonna have 40 seconds of a rower. Get your feet into those straps, tighten those foot straps. And then you're gonna row. Think about solid strokes here as you row. You're not trying to go fast. You're trying to see how many meters you can get in in those 40 seconds. You should be able to get anywhere from 200 on the low end to 400 on the high end, okay? Put the handle back in the holster when you're done. Hop out and come to the last station where over here we're gonna do a power curl to press. So, You'll start with that power curl. Little hinge at the hips, up to your shoulders, and then press overhead. Again, power curl, swing those hips up and then back, and then drive those arms up. Again, swing back, bring those dumbbells up to your shoulders, and press overhead. Deep breath in, and then blow it out here at the top. If you need to rest for any minute, any time, you need to rest with those here. Press them overhead, take a deep breath, and then go again. Power curl, press up overhead. Okay, that's it you guys, looks like a good one. Good job, Josh.